of course I've got dog hair stuck to my leg. Okay, hello everybody, how are you all doing? Today, I have an Urban Outfitters haul. I'm showing the bag to you differently today because the last haul I did, I only bloody showed my address, didn't I? Such a clever little bean. Anyway, who knew you could blur things out on YouTube without having to re-upload now? Thank you, YouTube. Thank you. So, if you haven't seen my Topshop haul, I will link it in the info box below. It was a very good haul. I'm super happy with so much of the stuff I got. I feel like I am pretty much ready for spring, summer. <laughs> so excited i've done a lot of shopping recently i feel like january february i give no craps about clothing and it just got to march and i was like i love everything i love everything so in the comments of my top shop haul someone actually said they were like it's always the same three brands in your haul so zara asos top shop um even though asos is a mix of other things but they were like i'd love to see something different from you and it just so happened that I had done a little Urban Outfitters haul. And normally I wouldn't show this on my channel, but this month I'm doing extra uploads. And also I bought quite a few things from Urban Outfitters, which I don't normally do. I normally buy like little bits and bobs, but I actually ordered quite a few things, which is rare for me. So I thought, why not? Why not do an Urban Outfitters haul? So yeah, that is what we are doing today. Thank you to the viewer that suggested um, this, like, cause they were literally like, what about Urban Outfitters? And, and a couple of other brands, but I was like, Oh, I have actually done a haul, so thank you. You've inspired this video. Let's get started with what I am wearing at the moment. I'm wearing this crop top, um, along with some tracksuit bottoms, because I'm never wearing a full outfit when I'm actually filming one of these videos. But I love this crop top. I love the colour of it. It makes me so happy. I love like neutral tones. You guys will know this. I'm in, very into my monochrome. Love a little bit of colour every so often, but neutral tones are my jam. And I love this very like sandy, oatmeal colour. I think it works really nicely with my um, tan at the moment. I love Paradise Tan, by the way, not as fun. Um, but that stuff is seriously good. So yeah, I'm really, really enjoying this colour. Um, and there's a few like of this kind of tone throughout this haul. So yeah, I'm really happy with it. I'll show you it with an outfit um, in the cutaways now. So this is the little like oatmeal sandy coloured top. I really like this. It just cuts like a really nice point. The sleeves are cut really nicely. Like everything about it is just like a nice cut i really really like it um the one thing i would say about this top is that it can be a little bit see-through so i'm currently wearing a white bra underneath this and it is fine and you can't really see it too much um in between the buttons but with a black bra it was so so visible and uh, yeah i would say you either need nude or white even white i feel like a little bit between here is kind of annoying but it's fine it's not super noticeable but the black was very very noticeable especially like on the back yeah it is just super super cute really really happy with it i think i'm gonna get a lot of wear out of this okay next everything is still kind of in it uh plastic i haven't i literally this is an unboxing i haven't opened some of these things so cross your fingers next we have this little crop top i'm pretty sure there is a matching skirt that goes with it there's actually going to be two of this crop top in this haul there were two at different price points and they were slightly different cuts and i thought i would just get both, test out which one I liked more, and then I could let you guys know um, as well which one I thought was um, the one that was more worth um, purchasing, because I was very confused over the fact that there were two that looked very, very similar, but like there's a few differences. So um, yeah, I'm really excited to try this on. Um, there's a few things that in this haul that I think I can like mix and match with. I'm super excited to try that on. This is the first of the two black tops. This is the more like structured one. Feels a bit more jersey-like so definitely feels um, a little bit cheaper in terms of quality but is a little bit more structured and I would say if you want something that's a bit more like structured and form-fitting this is probably the better of the two almost identical crop tops. Um, it really doesn't look like the same material as the skirt though in real life so if you want the matching skirt you'll probably have to go for the other one but this is like I said, the cheaper option does fit really, really nicely though. I think this would work beautifully with jeans, like boyfriend jeans. This would look so cool. Yeah, I think this would be a really nice, easy summer top. Next, what is this? I don't, this is always the way. I've had this sitting um, here for a few days. So sometimes I forget like certain things in the hall. There are certain things that I remember and certain things that I'm like, I don't remember what this was. This is so cute. It's like a little, um, what is this material? It's a very, very odd little material. Um, it's like that kind of like trouser material that Topshop were doing a lot in um, the autumn, but it's got a tie front. I don't know if you can 
really see that very well. It's like got a tie front, uh, so it's gonna be very like open at the front. I'm interested to see how this works, but I like the long sleeved. I thought it would work really nicely um, during the spring with like high-waisted jeans or um, just my trousers in general. Like, you know, I have a million pairs of trousers and I love them. I thought it'd work quite nicely because it's black, which means that when I'm like out in the sunshine, it will keep me warm, but it's quite light, so I won't like overheat. So I think that'll be a really nice like spring to summer um, piece. Oh my goodness. I love this. I honestly had a lot of reservations about this one. I did. I thought it was going to be super booby and I wasn't going to like it very much, but actually I love this. You can actually see um, the material of it a lot better in this light as well. Yeah, I really, really love this. I think the sleeves are so cool. Um, it's just like a really nice, easy piece. Like I could wear a bra with this. I could not as well. Like it's quite versatile. It doesn't um, matter too much. It's just absolutely gorgeous. I really, really like it. I feel like this would look so good with my, my hair slipped back into like a very chic little bun. Really, really happy with this. I think you'll see me wearing this a lot over the summer. This is going to look really nice with skirts and stuff as well, I think. I think the tan skirt I got from Topshop would look so cool with this. Maybe I'll try it on. Hold, please. Yes! I love this. I feel like this is going to be my colour palette for the summer. Like black and this like camel colour. Which is very unusual for me during the summer. I don't normally go for like such neutral tones. It's normally a bit more like pastel-y. Oh my god, I freaking love this. This next item was one of the items I remember being this haul. I'm really excited about it. It's this like silky cami in this sandy colour and it is just star. Ning. I'm very excited to try it on. It's got adjustable straps and we all know how I feel about adjustable straps. Very, very excited to try that on. I think this will be a really nice piece to just wear with like blue jeans in the summer. It's gonna be super nice and summery, but it also works, this color works beautifully with blue or black denim. And I just, I, re I really enjoy the versatility of, versatility, why did I say it like that? I really enjoy the versatility of that. Um, I think it will be a really nice like staple piece in my wardrobe. And I think it will end up being one of those pieces that I keep for quite a long time as well. So this is the little silky nude top. You can tell it's cold in here. I'm just gonna take a couple of steps back. Um, I really like this top. I haven't adjusted the straps too much. I've actually left it um, a little bit long, um, but I really like the cut of this. I like the way it falls kind of like does a little bit of a curve at the bottom from where it's tied. I love the button down detail. I think it is so, so pretty. It's just a nice little top. I think this is gonna look amazing with high-waisted jeans and like a nice pair of heels for a night out. I might adjust the straps a little bit, maybe. Not sure, we'll see how I go with it. But yeah, I just think it is so beautiful. Like the quality of it just feels amazing. Super happy with this. Yeah, I really like this. I'm definitely keeping this. This is the one thing about Urban Outfits that I do find that I don't buy from them massively often, but when I do, the things that I do buy from them, I do keep for a really long time. Okay, and then we have the second of the black, what would you call this, crop top, black crop top, that's it. Um, this one has a stretchy back. It's a lot thinner. Um, it's kind of more of a, like cotton material. Very, very similar though. Like you guys might not even be able to tell the difference on camera between them. It's mainly just the material. So this one is feels more like cottony, linen-y, um, whereas the other one is a much thicker, um, slightly more structured material. This is the second top. I wouldn't say it's as fitted as the first one. So if you do want a more fitted fit, then definitely go for the first one. This one's a little bit looser. The buttons actually undo on this one. Um, and I do have like a little like gapey bit there that I can stick my finger in but it's fine it's not revealing anything um I would say the straps feel slightly longer I guess because they're not like stretchy like the other ones are so that might bug me a little bit but probably not like massive amounts I love the fact that it matches the skirt perfectly though and in terms of the fit around my body it does fit really really nicely I would say the fit of both is very very similar like one it doesn't come like any bigger than the other I would say yeah I think in terms of the fact that I love the matching skirt I would definitely um keep this top um but i think the other one will work really nicely with jeans so it's a hard it's a hard decision this one you can't like slip over your head though the other one you can this one i have to like undo the buttons and button them back up so in terms of convenience the first one is probably more convenient but i do i do really like this one i like the material of it it feels um a little bit better quality then we have this here little skirt 
Um, this is like a white cottony linen-y fabric. Again, like the um, top that I just showed. It's got the lovely brown buttons down the middle. I always think these make... Uh, these types of buttons make things look a lot more expensive than they actually are. I think this would look beautiful with crop tops in the summer. I think most of the crop tops in this haul would work really nicely with this. Um, it's kind of like a midi length, I would say, on most. On me, it would be somewhere nearer a maxi length. Okay, white skirt. It needs an iron, of course, because it's been folded for ages, but I am not a fan. It's not doing anything for me. I also don't like the fact that it's just got, I hate it when clothing has this, where it's just got like a mini underlayer, but it doesn't go down the whole thing. So you just have this like weird cut off point. I really don't like that. Also the cut at the bottom of this is really horrible. Um, it just cuts off at the wrong point. This is too, way too square cut. Such a shame because this could be so beautiful, but it's just really, really not right. It's not flattering. I am gonna be taking this one back. Then we have another skirt. This is in like a, a lovely cottony like material. This is basically the skirt version of the white dress that I had from Urban Outfitters last summer. Like same buttons, same material, same pockets on the sides. Uh, but this was in black, obviously, instead of the off-white color that I had. This is going to be something that I know I will wear so much in the summer. I really like the fact that the buttons like go all the way down so you can decide how much leg you have out. I love the pockets on it. I love the material of it. It just feels very soft, very comfortable. It's a really nice quality material and the back of this um, has like a stretchy bit, which means it's going to be one of those things that's great for when you have a summer night out and you want to go like to a restaurant and drink wine and eat pasta and not worry about your food baby. So this is going to be amazing and again I think it will go with a lot of stuff in this haul, like all of the tops this will go with. So I feel like I've got some really good outfits in this haul, like it's just very very easy to wear outfits I'm super happy with. And this is the black skirt in full, there we are. <laughs> love the pockets on it. I love the fact that it's like my white dress that I wore so much last summer but in black and in like skirt and top form so I just think you get a few more outfits out of this but you can still have it like look like a dress if you want. I actually got this skirt in a medium and I may send for the small as well just to try it because this actually has a lot of like excess material around the waist um, which is fine because it kind of sits a little bit further on my hips like it doesn't sit exactly on my waist kind of falls a little bit lower which I do like because it shows a little bit um of my tummy and just kind of shows that it's a crop top so I'm actually quite happy with that it doesn't bug me too much yeah so that is the two in full I really like this cord it's so beautiful and uh, it just feels very like chic um and summery like it's very very hard for me to do black in summer but this is just like my perfect way of wearing an all black outfit in summer i also love how long the skirt is like this is probably a midi on most people so i would probably wear this fairly unbuttoned maybe not like probably not any more than this maybe <laughs> maybe one more depending on how i'm feeling but um yeah i like the fact that when you're walking it can kind of like part a little bit i just really like that and when you're sitting i just think that's quite like nice as well um so yeah i would probably have it unbuttoned a tiny bit um but yeah love 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 this so much big thumbs up yay very happy because i feel like some things in this haul haven't been as successful as i would have hoped but i'm really glad that this one uh this worked out and then finally we have this skirt i am so excited to try this on again i think this skirt will go really nicely with the majority of the tops in this haul it's a very very versatile slash potentially some might say boring haul um but i love this skirt like i really hope that it fits well it is gorgeous Oh, I just love it. It's like this very dark, almost bluey black denim and the stitching is all white. It's just, I love it. I absolutely love it. I think it's going to be quite short as well, which I am okay with. I love like a little mini denim skirt. I also think this bridges the gap between like a casual denim skirt. Like, you know, when you get a blue denim skirt, it's very, 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 very casual. Um, and this is almost like a little bit smarter. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's like the fact that it's not like frayed on the bottom. And I think the stitching like gives it a more structured look and just makes it look a little bit smarter. So I feel like this will be a nice one that I can wear to meetings in the summer and feel like it's just like a nice bridge between casual and smart. So this is the denim skirt. It fits so beautifully. Oh, I actually love this. It is so pretty. That's what it looks like. Oh my God, I love it. It's so gorgeous. It looks really nice with this top as well. Super, super happy with that. I think I'm gonna get a lot of wear out of this this summer. It'll work really nicely with basically all of my trainers. And we all know that that makes an item 
for me. Anything that I can wear with every single pair of my trainers, I am very, very happy with. Would definitely recommend it. Literally, honestly, it fits so perfectly. But yeah, it just fits like a little glove. Super, super happy with this. But yeah, love this. Love this so much. Would highly, highly, highly recommend. That is it for my Urban Outfit at all. I really hope you guys have enjoyed this video and you enjoyed seeing a haul from somewhere that's tiny bit different, not massively different. <laughs> as much as I would love to sit and chat more at the end of this video. <laughs> I'm gonna leave it here because <laughs> I'm slowly going insane. But yeah, I hope you guys are all having the best day. Let me know what you liked in the info in the info box below, in the comments below. Um, please don't forget to give this video a like and subscribe if you liked this video and you like my channel because it gives my ego the boost that it needs. And yeah, I love you all lots and I'll see you again soon. Bye.